Labor Day feels like the last hurrah before the end of summer. And with a three-day weekend, why not go barbecue or something? Get together with your friends, have a barbecue. It's like the last major three-day weekend before the end of the year and the major family holidays rolls around. If you don't have an option to do a barbecue and you don't have the option to smoke a brisket, which is my favorite cut, you can always try something else, which is like tri-tip, which is a much faster uh, leaner piece of meat to smoke, which is very popular. But since I can't smoke meat because I don't have the equipment to do it, I just basically am applying cold smoking, which is commonly used in cocktails, but I'm using it here. And because it's not quite the same as smoked meat, I basically have to infuse the meat. I've done this a couple of times uh, by putting the meat into a plastic bag and just replacing air inside with as much smoke as possible. And I make sure I flip it every single time to make sure the sides that are touching the plastic also gets exposed to the smoke as well. And before I roast it, I dry it and apply mustard rub to it. On one piece and at the other piece, I apply a slightly different rub, which is mayo and wasabi. I just wanted to try this out because wasabi, I feel like it's kind of almost like a horseradish. It's almost kind of like a mustard. So after roasting it at a higher heat to create a little bit of arc, I wrap it to finish it off to the desired wellness. And I do drop the heat and let it roast a little bit slow to break down the meat. And I also decided to make a simple slaw to go with it. And I made two different recipes. And I don't really show what the first slaw is. But again, the recipes are at the end of this video. So you could look there. But this is a simple apple and ginger uh, uh, dressing a slaw. I kind of stole the idea from Japanese restaurants, which actually has a sesame. I think they use sesame in it as well. And then I just made a really simple slaw to go with it. This case is just mayo and mustard and salt. So after the meat has a chance to roast to your desired wellness, you take it out and let it rest, unwrap it with oil, and then you just slice it against the grain to make sure it's nice and tender. This meat itself is a bit overcooked, but this is a very simple recipe that you could do at home. It takes maybe an hour or so, and it's the last run of summer. So play them together, enjoy your dish, and just have a good weekend to relax. Well, if you like this view, come back for another episode, and I hope you enjoy. Here's the recipe.